Hi friends, welcome to Lag Smiles 31. I am Sai Lakshmi. Hope you are doing well. In today's video, I am going to talk about butterfly chart in Tableau. Let's get started. Butterfly chart is a type of bar chart used to compare two data sets at a time. Butterfly chart helps us to plot the data as two horizontal bars with the same x axis in the center. This kind of bar chart resembles the butterfly wings. To create a butterfly chart, we need to reverse the bar chart to resemble like a butterfly. Let me show you how to create a butterfly chart and how to use it. Let me open Tableau public application. I have plotted the butterfly chart to show you how it looks like. This is how a butterfly chart looks. Let me show how to create it. I am clicking on new worksheet to create a butterfly chart. I have taken sample superstore data. So we need to take two measures to compare two different data sets. So I am taking sales and I need to create a calculated field to create a butterfly chart which is nothing but we need to write 0 in the calculated field and rename it as 0 axis. I am clicking on OK. Now I am bringing the 0 axis to the column shelf and again one more measure I am choosing from here. I am choosing discount now and bringing it here and again I am bringing the 0 axis calculated field to column shelf. I have taken two measures and I have created a calculated field and named it as 0 axis. I have brought the zero axis twice and we need to bring a dimension. For now, I am taking subcategory. Now, two different horizontal bars has been created. Now, in order to create a butterfly chart, first of all, I need to create uh, select a dual axis. Um, right clicking on the zero axis measure and selecting dual axis. The same way I am doing it on another zero axis field also. Now I am changing the mark type to bar not all of them. I am clicking on sales changing it to bar and I am selecting discount again and changing it to bar. Now you could see right zero axis mark is circle and this one also. Now what I am doing is I am selecting zero axis and reducing the size of the circle. I have totally reduced the size of zero axis and again I am selecting the zero axis secondary field and reducing the size of it completely. Now it is not displaying like a circle, it is like very negligible dot. Now what I have to do is synchronize axis and again right clicking on zero axis and again selecting synchronize axis option. Now both the axis are synchronized now the left side of the bar chart I am right clicking on it and editing the axis. I have right clicked on edit axis and checking the scale as reversed and again I am changing one more option which is fixed, fixed start. I am removing the value here and placing 0 and changing the fixed end to automatic and I am closing the window. Now the scale is reversed. Earlier it was 
a horizontal bar starting from accessories now it is starting from 0 to left I mean right to left earlier it was left to right the bar was left to right now I am doing the same on the another zero axis I am editing axis we don't need to change the scale to reverse over here because it is uh, already resembling um, butterfly chart we can do it for the left axis or the right axis now that we have completed for the left one we don't have to do it for the right as well again I am changing the fixed value from 0 and fixed end should be automatic and I am closing the window now it is completely resembling butterfly chart I am removing the headers we can hide this as well labels or we can hide the header now this is how a butterfly chart looks like we can compare two different measures at the same time we can do it with the side by side bar chart as well but when we are uh, like no when we want to grab the user's attention um, with a some with a completely new chart then we can go for this instead of going for side by side bar chart or bar chart this is how you can compare two data sets at the same time we can even do the formatting and clean it up a little I am removing the borders completely removing zero lines not trend lines rows grid lines to none and columns grid lines to none and sheet trend lines to none drop lines none I'm changing everything over here to none so that it will it will look clean and better as well and I'm cha removing the borders also grand total none column divider none header none I have completely formatted the butterfly chart we can add labels over here to do the comparison easily yeah this is this will go well with the scenarios like you no know, showing the literacy percentages of male and female or population percentages of uh, like no in particular region how many how much uh, of a male population is there and female population is there literacy rate of uh, male female and other genders so this will look well with those scenarios this is how a butterfly chart can be created and it can be used thank you guys thanks for landing at my channel lax mills 31 if you like my video or like my content please like share and let me know in the comments what could have been better and if you have any questions for me do let me know in the comment section don't forget to subscribe and hit the bell icon have a nice day bye bye